Dami News and the Anti-Corruption Crusade. The latest Corruption Perception Index released by the Transparency International on Thursday showed Nigeria slipped two places on the list. Nigeria now ranks 146 out of 180 countries, scoring 26 out of 100 points. Shegun Odumu tells us more. The summary of this press conference is this. The extractive industries and defense remain the hotbed of corruption. CISLAC and Transparency International concede that the introduction of the Treasury single account, anti-corruption convictions and modest breakthroughs in the introduction of beneficial ownership database of true owners in the oil and gas sector have provided optimism that corruption can be tackled at last. But despite all of this, Nigeria is still perceived as corrupt. Why? In politics and business are untouchable by the Nigerian law enforcement and executive. This we see every day in this country. So if you continue to do this, there's no way the Corruption Perception Index would be favorable to you. Sislak is quite aware that there will be a government backlash after this report. It however insists it is obvious Nigeria is making no progress on this front. It points to high poverty levels, insecurity and poor infrastructure as evidence. Corruption in defense and security sector is even openly lost by some government official. Illegal checkpoints, selective army defense procurement and corrupt uses of security both fuel insecurity and insurgency. Unlike previous reports, Transparency International and like are providing no recommendations for the government this time around. They are referring the administration back to last year's recommendations. Shegu Jumu, STV News.